ordered a hood scoop, uh, a cowl van scoop actually for the Jeep, and it came in the mail today. Got a really good deal on it on eBay, brand new. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, I guess get this installed. I think some of the water leak issues that I'm having, uh, some of the water might be coming in through this vent, so uh, putting this on should hopefully cut down on that a little bit. We'll see. And here's the scoop installed. Not sure how I feel about it at this point, but it's just on there with double-sided tape, so that's the design of it. I guess it's made so that the squirters will still work, which I will probably never use anyway, so we'll see. I do like the fact that it kind of blends in. I didn't want a stainless one because there's no stainless on this Jeep. So I'll run with that for a while. If I don't like it, I can always paint it, take it off, whatever. So we'll see. I think what I'm gonna do today is start working on refinishing the top. And that's going to include uh, probably peeling off this plastic dip and filling in a lot of the scratches and gouges that are on here and I went and got some satin black paint spray paint and some a can of texture so I can kind of blend in where all the scratches are going to be repaired I think I'm going to attempt to do this on the Jeep because I it's just going to be a little easier for me at this point so that's what I'm going to start to do okay so I got this thing mostly uh, prepped sanded. I got a lot of the scratches filled with either Bondo or Spot Putty. So right there I just got to do a final sanding on that and then finish taping it off and this thing should be ready to shoot. So I don't know how it's gonna look when it's done but I know one thing for sure it's definitely gonna look better. Stay tuned. So I've got about three or four coats on this thing and I think this is the best it's gonna get. I'm starting to <clears throat> unwrap it and it's a little bit splotchy and I I keep spraying it and it still stays splotchy. I don't know if maybe it's going to dry a little bit better uh, but I can always touch it up as needed. So just go ahead and finish unwrapping this now and find any spots I might have missed and uh, go from there. But it definitely looks a lot better than it did. So I'll show you to you when it's all unwrapped and outside. Not the best light, but here it is with the top all finished. Like I said before, it's a little mottled, so I'm probably gonna have to touch it up. Another day though. Definitely looks better than it did before. Yep, I'm pretty happy. Thanks for watching. We'll catch you on the flip side.